guys, welcome to Bar Z. My name's Stan, and today we got a real quick one, but it's more on the uh, ongoing conduit bending videos. I know a lot of guys were wondering uh, when you're going to make another conduit bending video. So we're going to do another one today, and I'll tell you what we want to do. We're going to travel across out of this box, we're going to travel across this cabinet. Uh, we want to come down an outside corner, but we want to change planes. We want to get off of this plane and get onto this plane right here. So we've already got our hardware mounted, and uh, as usual, this thing is out of here. So uh, let's let's throw the uh, throw a piece of pipe in there. Uh, there we go. And we're gonna engage it in our fitting. Now this is where our pipe's traveling, but we want to bend it down and get it up out on this side. And we're just going to use another little stub of pipe, piece of scrap, and put it in our other one here. And we're going to parallel it up. And now what I want to do is I want to make a mark for the back of my pipe right here. So that mark is to the back of my 90 degree bend. Get our scrap out of here. Now, if you recall from some of my other videos, we talked about to the back bends. And then we're going to grab our ideal bender. And essentially, we measured, even though we didn't use a measuring tape, but essentially, we measured from this direction. So, we're going to bend back towards that direction off of the star. And I don't know if the star is showing up too much, but it is right there. I'm coloring that bad boy in right there. So tip of the star, right on the line, give it a quick bend. more quick thing to do and right now we're not gonna we're not gonna be changing directions and we're not gonna be popping over to that other uh, other side we need to put a very very small uh, kick in it. we're gonna hold our pipe up um, handle and pipe 90 degrees from each other and literally the smallest kink you can give it just like that all right and that's what you end up with. Not much. But that's just enough to roll it over to the to an outside corner. And at this point now, we should be fitting pretty good. Let's give it a test fit here. And there you have it. We're in our, we're in our connector here, here, and here. All that's left to do is tighten it up, and uh, we've changed directions, and we're going about our business in the other in the other direction. Alrighty. Well, that's a tip of the day for uh, conduit bending 101. This is going to be what I think part three, and I'm just going to show as obstacles come up on the job. I'm going to show a little uh, how to get around them, and how to get uh, how to get your pipe around your obstacles. They're always going to come up, but you. If you know how to negotiate them, it goes quick and easy. All right, guys. Thanks for watching.